Hey everybody, welcome back to Gothic last time. We were out here in the sleeper camp and um, we found maybe a couple leads on things we can do. Uh, we also found that shack out there. There was a guy, but he ran off. I'm not sure where he went. Uh, but yeah, we don't want to tangle with the, the critters out there. So instead, we're going to go over and we're going to talk to these guys, I think. See if they've got anything interesting to say. Grab some herbs here, I guess. Healing herbs, sure. It's more swamp weed. Could be useful. Uh, all right, what do we got here? So we've got oh, even more. Excuse me, pick up the herb. There we go. Yeah, you guys are messing up. You're not even getting the herbs. Easy. Easiest thing I ever did. Grabbing all the uh, the weed and such. Well, that guy, that guy was trying. Uh, Baylor. Baylor got nothing to say. How can I join this camp? It's simple. Just let go, man. Talk to the gurus. They will guide you. All right. I was wondering if you would have anything to say about this guy, like, literally standing right here. But I guess not. Maybe this other guy has something. How can I join this camp? There's nothing simpler. Just talk to a couple of the junior gurus. They'll help you. You'll come to like it here. You'll see. Okay. So, yeah, well, I don't know how to do anything with that guy. Um, I guess we'll just move on. Aha, here we go. This looks like a guy. Let's, uh... Let's make a quick save here. What do you got for me? Who are you? I'm the guru, the guru of the swamp. My servants call me Bonnetbeck. Servants? I don't see any servants. They're everywhere. The trees, they walk and skip and dance. Oh, I see. Well, I'll be on my way then. Wait, you can help me convert this swamp into a massive meadow of flowers. Okay, you just got started. Me? I'll be back later. He's not going to get me anywhere. <laughs> uh, yeah, kind of rushed through those lines, I think. Hey, how's it going? Mind you don't hurt my trees. Yeah, okay, so that guy <laughs> apparently isn't really going to get me very far. I guess. Oh, my torch. Oh no. We had the torch since the beginning. I thought I really thought I'd be able to walk across here. Uh well. RIP in peace, Torch. We uh we hardly knew ya. <laughs> uh we have other torches though. What is this? It's like a piece of fire just uh hanging out. <laughs> in the uh the floating, floating in the void there. Sure. All right, so we talked to those guys last time. He said to come back when we were a Templar, which we are not. So what about you? Um, yeah, he's not going to give me anything, is he? Hi, I'm new here. <sighs> All right. Maybe one of these guys. Yeah, this guy. He's got a name, so surely he's got something to tell me. Let's get away from him and stop churning the, the butter or whatever he's doing here. Sir, excuse me. There we go. Good God. Hi, how's it going? I'm dead on my feet, man. I've been working for two days without a single break. Harlock should have taken over ages ago. It's always the same with that guy. He's probably lying in his hut, fast asleep. Why don't you just go there and give him a right kick in the butt? Can't leave here while Balorn is in charge. The work has to be done either way. But you could go there for me. 
He's staying right under Core Column's alchemy lab at Fortuno's. Tell him to get his butt over here. Okay, yeah, we can get some swamp weed while we're there, too. Oh, well, it looks like you're taking a break now, my friend. <laughs> All right, so these guys doing their thing. Um, yeah, we're... I actually I don't know where Fortuno is. is off the top of my head. Uh, it's, not, it's definitely not here. It's, it's going to be... This guy's got a name. Hi. I'm new here. The sleeper be with you, stranger. What can you tell me about this place? Well, the gurus are the most important people here. They spread the word of the sleeper and pass our master's visions on to the novices. Of course, he's too tired to talk to everybody himself. But on some days, he speaks to us in the temple courtyard and reveals the holy words of the sleeper. Gnarly. Um. Yeah, what are the holy words? Tell me about the holy words of the Great Sleeper. He tells us what we need to do to gain freedom again. Iberian says that the Sleeper will show us the way as soon as we're able to hear him. He's preparing a great invocation in which he'll contact the Sleeper together with the best novices. Kor Kalum supports him. He's an alchemist who brews substances which put us into a sleep-like state. You can only receive the thoughts of the sleeper in this state, or, or when sleeping. <laughs> of course. Get out of the way. Whoa, that uh, escalated quickly. Um, okay, so we uh. We can't do anything with Core Cologne because he told us to basically just go like do stuff with the the gurus. I think. Uh, are you uh, are you a guy? No, you're well, you are a guy, but you're not the guy. Um. Yeah, so we gotta. We know that we need to go find Harlock here. We need to go pay the dudes like bribe um, fee or whatever. As well, this maybe we can talk to this guy. Um, yeah, I think it's Melvin's friend here, so that he can come out here, uh, and then we'll probably have to do like one other thing, maybe. What are you doing here? I'm teaching the words of the sleeper to the novices. I'm still a novice myself, but soon I'll be a ball, one of the gurus. I've even spoken to Iberian. He's the chosen one. He told me that if I work hard, I can soon be a master myself. But I'm still putting that off. There's no rush. You understand? You I can still become a master anytime. At the moment, I'm quite happy about my current task. What's your task here? I test the new substances developed by Kor Kalam in his alchemy lab with my pals here. His aid gives us something new every couple of days, and we test it. This weed opens your spirit. If you take the right amount, you can get in touch with the Sleeper. Have you ever been in contact with the Sleeper? No, not yet. But that's because we never get enough of the stuff. Kalam always wants to hear about the effect of it. But I get the impression he's not really interested in my opinion at all. If I find the stuff stimulating, he passes it straight on to the Gurus. But soon, I'll be a guru myself. Then I can go right to my limits and listen to the voice of the sleeper myself. Oh boy. I'd like to join your camp. Can you help me? You want to join us? That's good. Just wait. Yes, I think I can help you. I'm not a guru yet, but I have some influence in the Brotherhood. You'd have to do me a favor. Have you seen Fortuno yet? Maybe. Uh, we did. Then you have your daily ration. If you give it to me, then we're in business. I'll think about it. I'm not listening to ah. I... Uh, I have some swamp weed on me, but I don't know that it, this is the Fortuno swamp weed, so I'm going to go to him and get the ration. But, uh, yeah, that sounds um, promising. Okay. 
So we got to find Fortuna. He's got, I think he's, he's like underneath some of these um, scaffolding type deals here. So I think if we cruise around maybe through here. Oh, I lost my heart. Oh, no. no okay, it's just the cricket stopped. Okay. <laughs> Thought we lost audio for a second there. Okay, yeah, here maybe? I don't think we've ever seen this. Um, who's this? El Kadar. Yeah, he's not going to have anything for me. Uh, I guess we can try talking to one of these guys. Yeah, they're all novices. I want to join you. You mean you've decided to serve the sleeper? A path of happiness and good fortune lies ahead of you. Go and talk to Kor Cologne. He'll decide what job you're most suited for. Okay, so yeah. As expected, nothing... new from uh, that guy. Uh, yeah, I think this is it, actually, right here. Any other guys here to talk to? Gore and the Drak. I don't know if I talked to him. Hi, where are you off to? We take the Minecrawler secretion from our brothers in the old mine to Kor Kalam. We go to the old mine every day to collect it. What kind of secretion is it? We obtain it from the mandibles of the mine crawlers. If you know how to do it, you can take them out without losing the secretion. Can you tell me how to get the secretion of a mine crawler? Of course. After you've killed the beast, you get hold of the mandibles and pull them straight out. This way, you'll get the secretion gland without destroying it. Oh, I didn't even have to, like, <laughs> give him anything. Just some, some free knowledge. What does Corkalam need the secretion for? As far as I know, he makes a potion with it which increases the magic powers of a novice. Since we are preparing for the great invocation, he can't get enough of the stuff. With the aid of the potion, he'll prepare the novices for the great day. Have you enough of the potion for the great invocation of the sleeper? No, we still have to collect much more. Our mind crawler hunting units are in action day and night. Whoops. Have you enough of... No. There we go. Um, yeah, so that's interesting. I think I've seen a mine crawler in like one of the game trailers. Uh, and I'm pretty sure if we can't kill a wolf, <laughs> a mine crawler is going to be out of the question. There's the guy. Okay, so first things first. Let's save the game here. Let's get this guy off his ass. Gorim sent me. What? Get your ass to the weed mashers, or you'll be for it. Just try to mess with me again, sucker. Okay. Sad performance. <laughs> try that again, and you'll regret it. Anyway. I think I can take that guy. With uh, just like a little more. Uh, care, <laughs> but uh, I don't know if I'm if I beat his ass if I'm gonna kill him or what. Um, let's try the other dialogue option first, I guess. Gorim sent me. What? I'm here to remind you that you're to take over from him. That's very nice of you. Remind me again when I'm through sleep. Yeah. Get your ass to the weed mashers, or you'll be for it. Just try to mess with me again, sucker. I just wanted to remind you to take your pal's place now. Listen, I told you to get lost. Okay, um... Hmm... What am, I, what am I looking for here? Forget the uh, 
<laughs> Forget what key I have to look at my journal here. Right, okay, so Gorm's replacement. Looks like Carl looks not only lazy but suffering as well. Perhaps I should help him along. Yeah, I think that's uh That's a hint that we need to beat his ass. So here's what I'm gonna do. What do you Smack a it? Fight. Clear winner, I'd say. Uh I think the the wall got in my way there. Weirdly enough, I think I'm better off. I was thinking I was going to get the jump on him, but he stands up instantly, so <laughs> uh, I guess that's not going to happen. So we'll just do it uh, like this. Up. Sad performance. A tiny gust of wind and he would have toppled over You're anyway. You're learning fast. So he doesn't seem to have anything. Is he dead? No. I think he'll get up in a minute. I don't think he's dead. Yeah, okay. You'll be sorry for that. Get out of the way, man. Looking for trouble again? Well, do you feel like giving your pal a break now? You damn pain in the butt. Why do you have to meddle in my affairs? I just want to see you mashing. Okay, okay, I'm on my way, sucker. Get out of the way. <laughs> okay, good. So we uh, we've done it. This is this is a milestone moment. We've uh, successfully beat the shit out of somebody <laughs> for once. Um, so that's nice. Uh, okay. I think uh, at this point, yeah, let's save the game for sure. Let's go get this weed. Come closer. Every newcomer to this place receives a gift of welcome. We also trade with them. Oh, let's get the ration first. I've come to collect my daily ration. Here, take it. Three of the Northern Dark. But don't smoke them all at once. There was a time when things would have gone very differently. I want to trade. What do you want from me? Or do you want to sell something? Uh, so he's got ore, which we do need. Looks like we have literally one ore. Um, what can we sell? Yeah, this, uh, this is different than the swamp weed that we picked up. Because we picked up, like, literally just actual weed. Yeah, right there. Unrefined uh, or whatever. Uh, I forget exactly how much money I ne need for, uh, for that guy. We have a, we have a ton of meat and a bunch of the Seraphis stuff. If we, oh wait, no, that's right, I can't do it that way, I gotta do, do it like this. Something like ten of those. A couple of beers, maybe. I'm thinking I'm gonna get like a hundred. Uh, but it might be more than that. I mean, we can always just sell more stuff at the uh, the other camp. All right. So we get a little bit of walking around money, which is uh, nice. We got two things we gotta do. We gotta go back and get a little pushed around by the geometry there. Um, we gotta go back and talk to, to Gorik. I assume anyway, and then uh, we gotta go back to the other guy. Is there another quest out here though? Let's see, novice, 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 novice. Okay, so this guy, yeah, I'm trying talking to him. So I'm not gonna get anywhere with that guy. I don't think. I think there is another name guy out here, though, somewhere. Templar, couple more novices. Uh, yeah, we can't do anything up there, as I recall. 
Okay, so maybe the guy's over uh, this way. Just the Templar. And yeah, this guy. Hellas. He's got nothing else to tell me. Okay. So uh, yeah, I don't remember exactly what I <laughs> what I talked to him about when I was here last, but I guess it wasn't that important after all. Okay. Yeah, we can come back and give this guy his uh, swamp weed. I have swamp weed on me. You can have it. Good. You must have noticed that none of the gurus wants to talk to you. You can change that by impressing them. I can tell you how to do that. I think we already know, but let's <laughs> follow the lead, I guess, since we already lost the swamp weed anyway. How can I impress the gurus? Balkadar instructs the novices in the magic of the sleeper. If you want his attention, use magic. But don't give him the fist to win. Send one of his audience to sleep or something like that. Bal Namib is over there at the main gate. He's one of the toughest guys. I think Lester might be able to help you with him. Speak to him as soon as his master is away. The other gurus are basically quite okay. Just try to make yourself useful. Thanks for the advice. Hey, a deal's a deal. Okay, well, I mean, that was more useful than I was expecting. Yeah, how can I get some magic, though? How do I get at the magic of the sleeper? Bal Kadar sells runes and spell scrolls. That's no use to you if he doesn't talk to you, right? Maybe another guru can help you. Hmm, apparently. Uh, alright. I think the other one's just gonna be a repeat of what he already told me, so... We'll, uh... Skip that one for now. It's just a tent. Uh, where am I going? I think we need to... We have to go around. I think I... Jumped over the wall last time. But uh, I think we got to go this way. Actually, yeah, this is where Lester should be. Is his, uh, is the guy gone? No. So we'll have to wait for an opportune moment uh, to talk to Lester again, I guess. See, I don't think we want to go that way. I think it, whatever we're looking for is going to be over here at this point. Just trying to get back to the mashers, I guess. Let's talk. Yeah, here we go. So let's go ahead and we'll save the game. Maybe the ball will talk to us now. Yeah, there we go. Harlock's doing his job. <laughs> I have spoken to Gorin. You have done one of our brothers a great service. Your cause was just. That's why I've chosen you for a special task. Kor Kalom urgently needs new swamp weed for his experiments. Our gatherers are working day and night. Go to them and take their entire harvest to Kalom's alchemy lab. Where exactly can I find the gatherers? I have not yet given you permission to address me. Pray to the sleeper that he may pardon your sacrilege. And now leave. Your mission is of extreme importance. Okay, well, <laughs> my bad, I guess. Uh, is Gordon still here? Or did he, yeah, he pieced out. All right, cool. All right, well, I think the gatherers are just back where we started, honestly. Back out here somewhere. Yeah, I think over here. And we already kind of grabbed everything, but let's just uh, see what they have to say, I guess. Yeah, this guy, probably. Balaron sent me. I'm to collect all the swamp weed. Good. Then I don't need to go myself. Here, take it. Don't forget to go to Viren on the other side of the swamp if you haven't been there yet. Otherwise, your load might be a bit small, and people might think you'd sold the other half of it. <laughs> Who could I sell the weeds to, anyway? Uh-oh. 
Now I've been putting ideas in your head, haven't I? <laughs> um, yeah, I'm not going to do that. Forget it. It was just a thought. Just keep picking hard. Of course. What do you think I'm doing? Rocking my balls? <laughs> uh, no, I would never imply that he was uh, rocking his balls. Of course, that would that would be insane. Oh, here we go. I could have crossed here and kept my torch. What a waste. <laughs> uh, however, that does mean we got to go to the other side of the swamp to find another guy who I actually don't think we've seen. So that could be a little bit uh, tricky. Um, can I get across here? I think I can. Probably want to go like up here. So, uh, what do you think? Is, that a, is there a guy there? No, it's a plant. Just taking a little peek out here. So we got a shark, we got bugs. Nothing that I want to mess with as far as I can tell. So I think we'll just go ahead and uh, try uh, maybe this way instead. See if we can find some more guys picking weeds. And actually, I mean, if it's anything like the other situation there, we can probably... Uh oh no, don't do that. Get away from that. That's a big zap <laughs> coming our way. Uh, I was going to say, we could probably pick some more herbs for ourselves as well. So, okay, that's like the limit of the map, I guess. We haven't looked at our map in a bit, but haven't really needed, needed to either. I mean, there's this guy. You don't look like one who submitted to slavery under the ore barons. You look more like a seeker. Someone who's searching for the true faith. Do you not feel a fire inside your body which keeps you from sleeping at night? I see. You doubt that what the ore baron slaves try to tell you is really true and just. You know why you doubt them too? They're lying. With those lies, they try to control weak spirits. But your spirit is stronger than their lies. Don't you feel a longing for freedom every single day? Don't you feel it growing stronger? It guides your spirit. Let it happen. Do you know what you're doing when you try to suppress it? You're denying your soul, denying yourself. Don't let your fears dominate your life. Free yourself. You need to understand. The sleeper will awaken. He will set you free and wash away all these disbelieving infidels. Like dross that is washed away by the rain, they will vanish from this world. They will moan, whine, and repent. But it will be too late. Then they will pay the price. They will pay with their blood and with their lives. That is some fire and brimstone shit right there. Uh, we aren't supposed to talk to him, so I'm going to say nothing. I guess. <laughs> I mean, this guy talked to me like... ran out of the gate. I didn't even do anything for him. This guy's just novices? Yeah, okay. So we'll... Uh, I guess we'll, yeah, we'll call it here. When we come back on on, <laughs> on that that note, on that rousing speech, uh, yeah, when we come back, we will go and um, find some more swamp weed. Looks like there's some guys doing stuff over there. I don't think we've, I don't think we've been over there either, weirdly enough. So uh, yeah, we'll maybe go see what these guys are up to. Looks like a little smithing maybe, and then. See if we can find the rest of the, the weeds and stuff that we need and kind of go from there. It's nice to be making some progress.